Hello Zimbabwe, hello South Africa, hello everyone around the world. Welcome back to BST African Electronic Surgery. And uh, we have some kind of job which I love most. We have a TV to repair. This is another LG TV. Four days ago we fixed another LG, LG TV and uh, it was coming on and goes off a few seconds after. The backlights were cutting off and that was a, a bulge capacitor. And this came in as no power. This is coming from a different customer. So, let me plug it on charger. It's plugged. You can see under this LG here, that's where the, 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 the log is. And the red light is flashing. It's flashing red light power on you can hear the switch is clicking it's not doing anything it's just dead so that's what you have to fix so what do you f what do you think is the problem a flashing standby light a flashing standby light according to me it means uh, we have some kind of power issue there Maybe fluctuation of voltage on the output or can be some kind of bulge capacitor or can be anything. So I will say, let me open up the TV and we'll see what's going on there. So this model of LG is slightly different from the one that we fixed four, 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 four days ago. The one that we fixed four days ago, the power supply was like this. Like an all-in-one power supply, whereby we have the power supply, we have the logic board on one board. This one, the switching power supply is, is separate and the logic board is separate. So when I was taking out the, 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 the power supply, I found something weird. Maybe you can spot the problem. So what do you think is the problem of this TV? Hmm? What do you think is the problem? This capacitor is flat. This 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 is some kind of bulge capacitor. Exactly on the output. Because here we have the connector which is going to the logic board. And this capacitor... 10 volts, 470, is, uh, is gone. It's got a bump on top. And this capacitor, what? Eh, <laughs> yeah, I think that's explain why this TV is fluctuating. Or uh, why the standby voltage is fluctuating on the output. Check this capacitor. <laughs> Check. This is some kind of blown up capacitor. Huh? And it's also 10 volts, 1.5 micro. So exactly these capacitors, they are there to filter voltage, which is going to the logic board for the standby. So let's replace this capacitor. And we'll see if that is only the problem. That's all what we have to do here. The fault is obvious. Some kind of obvious fault. Hmm? I was expecting to have something like a complicated job. But I think we are lucky this time. So let's replace the capacitors. Let's replace the capacitor. Let's open the veins of the capacitor using disordering pump. Someone asked me on the video, what, what is this? This is just a disordering pump. So we have to open the veins. It's very simple to use. The veins are open. 
You can see here. So now we need the replacement. Oh. 10 volts, 1.5. 10 volts, 1.5. Where can I get this kind of capacitor? Oh. And the other one is 10 volts, 470. Let's check here. Let's take this one for 470. And where is the other one? So it's all about capacitors here. I don't think we have a secondary fault. But with such kind of capacitors, it's very common on TVs to behave like that. I found many TVs. Now, replacing the capacitor. I'm lucky to find the capacitor on one board. Same value capacitors. The capacitor with the same values. Where's the other one? Here. Yeah. What a lucky Monday. Usually on Monday, I'm, joy I'm getting some kind of hard jobs. On Monday, I'm getting some kind of hard jobs. The second capacitor. The magd, the magd side on the capacitor, that the minus, and the unmagd area side. That's the positive. All good. All good. We replace these capacitors. So I will say, give me another few minutes. I'll put all together and we come back for testing. Just a few minutes, less than five minutes to put all screws together. Now let's test the TV. Let's test this TV. I'll plug in. Yeah, the, the power cable is like the AC adapter for laptop chargers. So I'll plug in the, the cord, cord plugged. And the TV is on. You can see on the screen. It's working fine. 
You can see the no signal sign. This one. It is working fine. Off. Let's see if we can power off this TV. Off. And on. That is on. HDMI 2. And the TV is working fine. So basically that's how you can diagnose and fix a dead TV. So if you have a such kind of TV, is this is LG Lenovo. This is the LG model 32L B53 Zero A. That's the model of this LG 32-inch TV. The TV is working fine. Hmm? Settings. Check on the screen. Everything is working fine. So, like, subscribe. Don't forget to turn on the notification bell for future updates. And see you on the next one. Bye.